What is up guys? We are back for another episode of Fallout 4. Continuing where we left off at the Pruden. Pride I'm gonna say Pruden. We have another crate of technical jobs. Glad you finally stopped by, soldier. Ready for your medical exam? Mm. As long as it doesn't involve petroleum jelly and rubber gloves, I'm ready. No no. This isn't that sort of First question. As a child, were you ever exposed to radiation for an extended period of time? Mm, no. So check your records, Doc. I'm not from around here. What's that? Let me check my notes. You were a vault dweller? You're probably healthier than anyone else aboard. Thank anyway, you. Sorry I missed that in your records. Just going down the list of questions. I'm sure you understand. Okay, second question. Have you ever had or come in contact with a person confirmed to be carrying a communicable disease? Uh, I mean, I got the Morat disease, but... Um, I don't know if that counts. Are you um, feeling well, soldier? Hello. Sorry, I'm just, I'm just thinking about my decision here. Um. I hope that you're kidding. Not at all. I just go with that. However, I'll just assume that your answer to that one is a no. It's a no and a yes, but. You know, you don't have the option, so... Honestly, have you ever had sexual relations with any species considered non-human? Oh, come on, Doc. I ain't a freak like that. <laughs> I ain't a freak like that. I find the practice highly distasteful. Last question. Would you have any problems pulling the trigger on an enemy of the Brotherhood, whether they're human, formula, oh. or machine? It depends. I mean, it depends I who it is. So. Good enough. Excellent. I think I've got all the information I need. Oh, dang it. Did I, I just no choose the wrong thing? If you ever need medical assistance, you let me know. I'll let you know, mister. Uh, he's an interesting oh, character. You're finally here. Just set the books down anywhere. I'll get to them as soon as I can. Huh? I think you're confused. What? Not even a thank you. I hardly need to. Oh my! It appears I've mistaken you for someone else. Since it's obvious that you aren't who I was expecting, would you mind telling me why you're here? Well. Maxon wanted me to meet the crew. You were next on my list. Ah, yes. You must be the new recruit described in Paladin Dancer's report. Who is I'm directly behind me? Just so you know. I provide you with a proper orientation. However, I'm woefully behind setting up research patrols and getting bombarded with requests for technical documentation. Unfortunately, I'm lacking the personnel needed to get the job done. I guess I can help. You don't seem too weird to me. As you patrol the Commonwealth, keep your eyes open for blueprints, memos, manuals, books, charts. Anything containing useful technical data. I'm authorized to pay you for each bundle of documents that you recover. And if you wish to be assigned to a research patrol, I have plenty of them waiting to be found. Fantastic. It was a pleasure to meet you, Knight. I can do that command, so I, uh, I'm just gonna have to, you know, shake, you know, my head. There you go. That's that's the best you got. Okay. All right. Try it now. Nothing. I was supposed to report ten minutes ago. You can't fix it. I can fix it. You're the one who decided to kick your way through a mire lurk. <laughs> Hold on, you kicked him. You kicked your way through. There it is. <laughs> Thanks, brother. I owe you. Oh, now you're being like, you're being nice to him. Really? Now you're being nice to him? So. Hello. Not what I was expecting. I 
can handle myself. Hey, if Paladin Dance vouched for you, that's good enough for me. No, oh, you're not showing me much respect, woman. I'm getting offended. Anyway, since you came down here to meet me, you may as well get it over with. Okay. And this lovely little grease pit is where you'll usually find me. I, I see that. Tight in the crotch, the good one's about to crash into the ground, or a robot's gone haywire. You come see me. All right. Thanks. While you're at it, my car is making this weird grinding noise when I back it out of the driveway. <laughs> you're gonna have to take a number. And since I'm stuck in this rig, I'm not quite as spry as I used to be. The work tends to pile up. I see. I mean, I didn't notice it. Did you guys notice it? You feel like telling me how you ended up that way? That's a little personal, don't you think? Psst. Hey, I'll keep it a secret. Would it help if I <laughs> promised not to tell anyone else? Okay, okay. <laughs> <laughs> I was fighting with the Brotherhood in the Capital Wasteland. Worked with a security <laughs> after the power of the troops. <clears throat> Our position was along a ridge line overlooking the battlefield. I'd say it was a hundred foot drop, give and take. Oh, so you dropped, like, from the plane. Was she in armor? Uh... That's quite a drop. The enemy had no way of getting to us up there. It was a perfect liftoff point for the vertebrates. I guess you're story right. Short, the ridge I was standing on took a hit from the nuke, sheared most of the cliff right off, and caused the platform I was standing on to tumble over the side. If I hadn't been test piloting one of the power armor suits at the time, I would have died. Oh. It's a miracle. It's a miracle you survived. Nope. Just simple engineering. My power armor absorbed most of the impact. Well, that's I good. Both of your legs crushed, surviving. Anyway, I mean, I'm sure you're here to get your hands on some power armor. Okay, now I see the legs. sitting in bay three. It's all yours. The left leg actuator's a bit sticky, but it'll keep the creeps off of you. Oh, oh gee, thanks. Done on it. Feel free to use the workshops around here. Oh, oh so nice. Me. I need to get back to work. Uh, okay, you do that. I got a call, uh, righty then, hold on, excuse me guys, let me just take this call. Sorry about that, you guys. Family uh, issue going on. As we continue. Even though they locked me in this blasted cage, I promised that I'd be fine. Um. Oh, this. Okay, this this is the cage. Why are you in there? I'm glad you asked. Now this is the stowage depot, and I, as you probably all know, am the ship's quartermaster. Quarter master. Master of the quarters. Keep an eye on the Brotherhood's valuables. Cool. If you need to stock up on supplies before you head out on a mission, this is the place to buy them. Okay. Cool. So if I'm out of caps, I guess I'll just defeat the enemy with my bare hands. There's plenty of spare ammo and equipment all over the ship. Help yourself to anything you can find. Everything in here is a bit more specialized and unique. Okay, I feel you. By having a constant flow of caps, I'm able to buy whatever you bring me. I'm All mostly right. interested in weapons, but I'll take anything useful. Okay. Of course, if you're just looking to make a few caps on the side, I might have some extra work for you to do. Ooh, okay. 
I could use some extra caps. You need them, and I want you to spend them here. It's a match made in heaven. It just involves a little bit of heavy lifting and interacting with the local farms. And since I'm stuck up here manning this one-man zoo, well, I need here. someone to do the work for me. After you're done with the meet and greet, we'll discuss the details. In the meantime, if you ever need anything else, gun, mod, even ammo, you just let me know. All right, Mr. Quartermaster. All right, looks like I am um, done with that. That's good. Let me go see what's next on my bucket list. Show no mercy. Do 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 do. He's over there. Pew, 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 pew. The tour of duty. Hey, where'd he go? Oh, he went outside. Uh, sorry if you hear background noise. My sister refuses to get out. It's one of the downsides of living with your sister. And she has half of the room. So, yeah. But anywho, we're not here to talk about that. We're here to see Mr. Maxon. I mean, to be honest, he doesn't look that old. So why call him elder? I mean, if you have gray hairs, then then you're elder. But seriously, it's like right now, come on. Man has like black hair. How can you call him that? Look, it's all black. Are you ready for your next assignment, sister? You just point me to the action. I applaud your enthusiasm. Let's get right to it, shall we? Take a look over there. That's Fort Strong, and it's infested with super mutants. Having those aberrations of nature close enough to smell is making me sick to my stomach. To make okay. matters worse, they're sitting on top of a massive stockpile of fat man shells we could use in our campaign. I want you to head over there. Wipe out everything that moves, and secure that stockpile. Understood? Uh, we know what a fat man is, but if you don't know, it's like a, um, it's like a rocket launcher, but it shoot, you can actually see the, 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 the fat man shells shoot out of it like a launch, like a launcher. It just does tons of damage, so, Consider it done. yeah. Look, I realize you're eager to take the fight to the Institute. But it'll have to wait. The okay. Brotherhood cannot allow these abominations to have a nuclear arsenal at their fingertips. It'll be a pleasure to exterminate that mutant filth. Now, the mutant filth. Stand by, fully armed and ready to depart. Use it to carry our message to Fort Strong and wipe those dirty mutants from the face of the earth. Dismiss. All right. Like I said, still can't do that sick that uh that little motion, you know. Let me go get some power armor and then we'll go do that, you know. Hmm. If I'm being honest, I'm probably going to need that power armor. Because I have never set foot over there on this profile or any other profile. So it says a lot. Oh, I gotta, I gotta go up. Hold on. This one. No, not... Okay, just go around. There you go. Gotta go grab my power armor. Power armor. Power armor. Gotta go grab my power armor. Gotta grab my power armor. Cause I got the power. Power. The beauty. Beauty. I got the power. Oh, this is Bay 3, sorry. Mom called? Yes, she did. Y'all didn't come get me. You were in the bathroom, so we I didn't... I was in the bathroom. I need to unlock the door. door. Mm. 
right, let's boogie. Just gonna take a vertebra over there and just that's it. Or are they just gonna take us down to the airport? We're about to find out, I guess. So we are taking the chopper there. Are we? We're going the wrong way. So there you go. There it is. I can almost see it. Um, Fort Strong. He's just going to drop us off, isn't he? Um, I don't see any of them. Oh, never mind. Light them up, light them up, light them up, light them up. Whoa, there's a freaking behemoth here. I did I, I came across one of these before. That's why I know its name. Jeez, he is chucking those rocks. We are lighting him up, though. Oh, so close. Come on, come on. There he is. Come on, light him up. Got him. Ah, I can't see. There you are. I wish I could just rip this off. Come on, come on, come on out, come on out. I thought I lit you up. Oh, there he is. Being in the open, so here we are. Fort Strong. The behemoth. I will take that, that, and that. As for this, um, do I need it? Uh... Let me see. A seventeen. Um I could use it. Oh yeah, I guess I could use it. Leg armor. I'm good on that. Oh, so I can't oh yeah. Oh well I guess I can't do that. Alrighty then. In we go. He 
He's ready for some adventure. Come out, come out. Wherever you are, super mutants. Come out, come out, come out. Wherever you are. I'll shoot, I'll shot you in the face and legs now. I'll laugh all day long. I hear something. I know you hear something. That's me shooting your head off. I'm gonna now open this door and bust the cap in your behind. <laughs> nice. Here it comes, right here. Oh, uh, come on, come on. Yeah, there, that's one. That's one of them. Why is it so little chance? I'm like so close to him. What the heck? Final shoot, 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 leg. Eh. And now I'm gonna hit you. Wait, I can't hit you. What the heck? <laughs> Granata. Boom. Really? That did nothing? There you go. Where does other buddy go? Where? Is it? Oh, they're all out here. Oh, he ran across there. Take that! Boom! Oh crap! It's a master. It's a master assassin. Fantastic. That's how we do it. This is how we do it. Dun, 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 dun. Uh, it doesn't really have too much use for me right now. Uh, now, where is that thing? Wait, do we have the thing highlighted at all? Oh, secure it. So I gotta shoot every last super mutant I come across. So, is there some kind of stair system? Oh, wait. Oh, there it is. Oh, you can climb up there, but... Eh. Jump up there. Uh, stairs are crumbled over here, so I guess the elevator. Huh. Alright. Up we go. Ew, my eye. There you are, see? He just pops up for some reason. I'm surprised he didn't... He wasn't in the elevator, so... Yeah. So, like, even if you do wait for them, sometimes they don't even get into the, like, the elevator, which is kind of upsetting. I don't see any um, bombs anywhere, do you? I'm seeing nothing. Oh, I'm seeing a hound up. Light that hound up. Alright. Where's that skirmisher? I just saw him. There. Hi! You ain't shoot me with a rocket launcher on your life. What the heck? I just had grenades on. There he is, right there. Get him. <laughs> Does so much damage. Ah, there he is. I'll take those bottle caps. Uh, trust me, I won't. This, <laughs> I'll tell you one thing, this shotgun does work. That is for sure. See, I got missiles, missile launcher here. 
I might come back for it. Oh. Is this the place? So, is it upstairs, I guess? I'm guessing it's upstairs. <laughs> oh, I gotta speak to him. Dance. Look at this place. You must hate these mutants as much as I do. Well, I mean... I wouldn't say I hate them. Even though I made a song about them. I was just doing what Elder Maxon asked. No more, no yeah, just take well, orders. It's good to see you dealt with the Brotherhood. Right? These monstrosities are just another example of man blindly taking a step forward only to wind up stumbling two steps back. I've been fighting for years, trying to put a stop to this madness. And just when I thought we were getting the upper hand, along come the sins. I've seen what these super mutants do to people. Can you imagine what the Oh yeah, they they just slaughter people. <laughs> It would be Armageddon repeated, and maybe the end of everything we hold dear. Well, considering we got I just want bombed, to understand how important these missions are. Um, I wouldn't say it, it would be the worst thing ever. Don't apologize. It reminds me why I'm doing this. Thank you, sister. It's good to know you're taking my advice to heart. Anyway, that's enough of that. I'm surprised he's not wearing his helmet like he usually does. You should head back up to the Fred with Dr. Maxon. I'm sure he'll want to debrief you as soon as possible. Dismissed. Seriously, that's it? That, that's all we had to do? I don't see any shells anywhere. Just so you know. But you know, I'm just, just gonna, I'm just gonna go. I am just gonna go. Uh, I gotta make sure all my stuff is reloaded. I think we are all good. All right. I guess that was an easy mission. We just had to clear them out, and I guess I guess they'll find the bombs themselves. I guess. I mean, I would have found them, you know, if you gave me the order, but you didn't. So. I'll take care of the shells and the mess. Okay. Nice kicking it with you. Don't know why you're not wearing your helmet. Bye now. Back to the pride, the pride win. It, it's so hard to, uh, I guess, pronounce. <laughs> it's such a weird name. Why would they name it like that? Like they couldn't think of anything else. I don't know. It's me. All right. Let's just go back to Mr. Maxon. I guess I'll take my helmet off. I mean, I don't need it on necessarily right now, so... Weapons down. Outstanding work at Fort Strong, soldier. Are you gonna look at me? Thank you. It was an honor fighting for the Brotherhood. I'm glad you feel that way. Because our mission here has only just begun. In order to bring the Institute to its knees, we need to use every weapon at our disposal. I try to supply my soldiers with the best. That's why I'm giving you these. Signal grenades can call a vertebrate to your location when you need aerial transport. Simply throw one to the ground, and the vertebrate will hone in on the unique electromagnetic smoke it emits. Once you're aboard, use the map on your pit board to interface with the pilot's navigation system, so he'll be able to take you wherever you need. Okay, that's 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 very generous. Thank you, Elder. I'll make good use of you. I expected you would. Now, 
I'm sure you're aware that Fort Strong is simply the first step towards the liberation of the Commonwealth. An even greater task lies ahead. You're not getting another assignment until Fort Strong has been secured. Why did he sound so angry when he said it like that? Hull plating integrity looks good. No need for adjustments. Um. Ninety-three percent compensating. He just he just seems so mad when he said that. Yeah. Well, anyways, I guess that's the end of this episode for now. Um, I don't know what. Oh. Well, th there's this, but that's the only thing that's left. So, until next time, guys. Deuces.